Hello my 3D printer peeps. I am sitting here in front of a Bamboo Lab P1P slash P1S screen. Those screens and interfaces are identical. And today we are going to reprint a previously completed model using only the P1P P1S screen. To do that, wake up your screen by touching any button. You will notice a little square around the icon on the left. That is your active category. Use the arrow keys to scroll down until highlighting the folder icon. There is only one option in the folder category. That option is cache. If it is not already highlighted, press the right arrow to highlight it and press OK. After pressing OK, you will notice all your previously completed models will show up in the list. Unfortunately, this list is very basic. There are no images. You will have to know the name of your file. If you plan to use this feature, it is wise to take that into account when naming your G codes so that they are easy to recognize via their name only. Once you locate the model you'd like to print, make sure it is highlighted and simply press OK. You will then be offered a screen with some information about the model. This is the current date and time. This is how long that model is estimated to take for printing. And this is the estimated grams of filament that model will require. If everything you see looks okay to you, go ahead and press the print button. Your P1P slash P1S will send the print job to itself and begin the print immediately. Once that process has completed, it will switch to your typical print progress screen and away you go. Hey.